Alright guys, what's up? It's Ease again. Ease chill. He's also chilling on the screen. This time it's Ghost Recon Future Soldier. Yes, I know I am a little late. I'm a little late. Probably more late than most on Ghost Recon on this DLC news as you saw from the title. But since I gave you Ghost Recon with the uh, with the the beta and you know, kept y'all with codes. I feel like I owe it to y'all. I just can't help but have Ghost Recon in the back of the list right now. I'm not hating on Ghost Recon and all. This is a phenomenal game, especially the multiplayer. Um, I just think in the middle of all these shooters, it's hard to kind of compete. You know, you have to kind of be a diehard in Ghost Recon and really love Tom Clancy or just probably not have any other games like um, Gears or Call of Duty, you know, in my library or in your library right now but that's how it is but a lot of you guys already know this is this has been delayed at first it is the uh the arctic strike pack i, I believe it was going to come out sometime earlier this month it, they had to push it back i guess to get the polishing done right but now it's coming out next week on the 17th of july that is next tuesday on playstation 3 and xbox 360 for 800 microsoft points and that's not bad. I mean, for what they're giving you, it's a, it's a pretty significant amount of stuff. I mean, you're going to get a level cap increase of plus 10. I believe the level cap right now is 50. I believe 50 is for every um class. You have to get up to level 50. And um, bring that up, and that's going to be 60. That's pretty good. Plus, you're going to get some achievements. And um, you're going to get some weapons as well. Six new weapons, two for each class. You're going to get the F-2000. And the CZS805 as a rifleman. As a scout, you're going to get the Type 05JS and BT MP9. And for the engineer, you're going to get an OCP11 and MK17. I have no idea what any of those weapons are except for the F2000 and the MP9. The BT MP9 I've never heard of before, but um, sounds like it's going to be a, a nice looking MP9. I guess more modern well, what's going on if you're into guns you probably know what I'm talking about but besides that you're also going to get a guerrilla co-op map and a new multiplayer mode called stockade that is I don't know what stockade is but it sounds like it's going to be something nice I mean a new gameplay gameplay mode maybe it's going to be something brand new and different because right now you're, I'm showing you see just basically search and destroy from call of duty it's basically the same concept and um, you're also going to get three new multiplayer maps I almost forgot uh, I don't know what the multiplayer maps are, but you're going to get them in there. That's kind of limited on the information. I'm going to give you probably two or three links in the description showing you where to go. I just got my information from JustPushStart.com. Um, they seem to have some pretty good information. I found them out through um, Scoople. If anybody doesn't know what Scoople is, go to Scoople.com or Scoople on your apps. I believe you can find Scoople in any of your apps. But um, that's it. In and out, real quick. It wasn't even five minutes. That's kind of what I liked about Siege to give you this information. Really, in and out, no nonsense. Quick to the um objective. But in case you didn't remember, my name is Ease. Subscribe, comment, like, dislike, favorite, whatever you want to do to get me out there or not get me out there. Let me know, and um, y'all be easy.